Hey folks, and I'm back. So, I can't record for much longer, I'm getting rather tired. Though I don't know whether I sound it or not. I've been on the phone exhausted before I say it, and like, people are like, oh, really, I didn't notice. So, I have no idea if it comes across. Um, right now it actually doesn't. I almost feel like I've woke up every so slightly. But my throat's getting sore, and I suppose I could open the other bottle of cola downstairs. Uh, I'd have to go downstairs and come back and keep recording. Mm. Anyway, Anytime you're ready. I have to mark. I have to do all this very quickly. Oh, excuse me. A repair. Get over there. And now you can get this base once you find the command center, I think. Yep. Go deal with that. Rainer's fine. A Terran building with hit points in the red will burn down unless it's repaired. So yeah, it's only now telling you this. This is going to be a very long mission. Um, this is going to, if successful, it's still going to take like an hour. If we're doing this, we better hurry. That ship won't last long against those Zerg. Okay. These can re these are on your side, uh, your team. So as long as you have resources, they can repair. But if you want to repair the Goliaths, they need gas. Not enough minerals. So you have to keep that in mind. <clears throat> oh, throat's hurting. Um, your your bases is also also in danger. In there. Commander will get jacked up and good to go. So. Go ahead, Commander. I find, uh, found um, when I was trying to level, the enemies mostly attacked di from here, from either over that side or this side. On a few occasions, they did flank around, but the vast majority of them attacked from this way. Also, don't hit this button. You'll grab these as well. You'll f that will frequently. That's how you'll end up getting those killed. As long as they're getting repaired, the Zerg won't toss enough troops at uh, the NORAD to actually destroy it. Well, sorry, at the Goliaths to actually destroy them, as long as they're getting regularly repaired. And back you go. Anytime you're ready. Target designated. Oh fuck, fuck. Like I said, it will get them killed quite quickly. There is a spine colony impaler colony, I don't remember what it's called. But there's basically the Zerg ground defense right outside. The three things aren't enough for it. Aren't enough to deal with it, at least on hard. It just does way too high damage. I'll save the moment we get into it. Of course they have to crash land like right in the middle of all that. They couldn't crash land on, you know, a nice beach in Maui or something like that. No. Right in the middle of fucking Zurg. Well done, Duke. Even, you know, nearly dying you're a pain in the arse. They lost their far bat. I found no enemies ever actually attacked from this angle, so still tossing troops, it's probably a good idea, but I I've never seen um one second. 
uh, whether or not there's a benefit to it. That ship won't last long against those Zerg. Standing by. Anytime you're ready. Rock and roll. All right. The way I'm, I end up doing this map is I firstly build up a base here, solid defense here, starts off um, way you saw it earlier, um, bunker here, bunker here, also one second, um, bunker here, bunker here, and some um, anti-air turrets. Then I spread it out to here, line of bunkers, connecting to here. And then once I expand up here, there's some minerals here. There's a spit of land here. I toss up a few bunkers there. They tend to be a little like more inclined to fall than the, my defensive line, I think. These are tossing up forces there that my repairers just don't do enough. But I have been able to complete this well enough. I want to toss down a second bunker. I want to get down quickly as a big attack is actually incoming. Don't know when, but we'll launch soon enough. Uh, first attack is just a mass of zerglings. Uh, nothing more dangerous than that, but still, it's a ton of fucking zerglings. Um, I've had cases where they just take this bunker down. And then the bunker has a fair bit of health. I did notice actually the supply depots have about the same amount of health as. Uh, well, actually, more health than a bunker. But you can't make these burrow around. Designed to be. St designed to safeguard troops from enemy fire. Let me just save. Uh, bunkers are, can be constructed to defend any pivotal location. Bunker typically accommodates, but is not limited to, four individuals. Weapon ports are located on all sides, with ammunition racks above them. Entry and exit is through a single hatch to the rear. That went well, but there's going to be more attacks. It's not just going to end at just that one. That would be a very strange level. Like, oh, Zerg just tossed one little attack at you, that's it. Yeah. Kind of strange. I need to get the refinery up as soon as possible, as there is constant attacks coming at these. Well, not constant, it's once in a while there's an attack. repair. Um, there's attacks coming here once in a while. Also, that creep does look kind of cool there. Uh, ooh. No rat. General uh, Edmund Duke has, was a stalwart defender of the con Confederacy um, for over 40 years, motivated by his love of power and control rather than any heartfelt political affi affiliation. Um, Duke has earned a reputation for running things by the book. His long years of service with Alpha Squadron has left him with extensive tactical experience, making him one of the greatest military minds in the Terran sector. Despite his abilities, Duke's ego and insufferable pride often lead to hostile confrontations with those under his command. Yeah, sounds like a real, you know, real treat. This can. It's unnerving how easily this can go poorly. Missile turret. Uh, this level can. 
Missile turrets are relatively inexpensive structures that will automatically target and fire upon incoming enemy aircraft. Um, they also serve as sentry stations equipped with powerful sensors capable of detecting cloaked vessels. I know Fordham may seem a little overboard, but I need him. Uh, you get attacked by a fair bit of air units. It's always unner unnerving to hear that um, random sound effect that happened just a second ago. There, there it's again. I don't know what it's in relation to, but it, I find it unnerving. Cause probably because I don't know what it is. Keep seeing, I keep end up thinking I'm getting scanned by someone, even though I'm the one with scanning tech, and not Zerg. Not enough minerals. You want a piece of me, boy? Base is under attack. SCP, good to go, sir. You want a piece of me, boy? <sighs> Let's grab two over here. Toss them here. Auto repair. So yeah, we have to uh, protect the battle cruiser NORAD two, and bring Rainer and two dropships to the NORAD uh, two. Um, reason this hover over there is sometimes some extra text does pop up if you do so. I remember that with Odyssey. Doesn't do it here, but I was just checking in case it did. Oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Ah. Oh, that's annoying. Fuck. Uh, that's gonna happen so many times. And it's been ages since I saved. Okay, I think I might call quits for tonight. Just purely a case of I'm tired. I I'm just gonna keep making that mistake over and over again. So I, I better off I'm better off to just um call quits for tonight, come back tomorrow or whenever and I'll have a better time then. It just I made that mistake a lot when I was awake on playing this level. I have more force of habit than anything else, and now that I'm kind of tired, I'll probably make that mistake a fair bit more. So, I'll see you next time, folks. I sincerely hope you've enjoyed this so far. I actually really did enjoy playing this. I find it's actually... I'm, when I first played it through by myself, I was like really into it. I'm not enjoying it quite as much now, but I think it's a case of nerves while I was recording, rather than anything else. Um, but yeah, I really advise giving checking this out. Um, it's it's a good it is you know a good map pack campaign cut custom thing. I don't know. I'm tired. Words aren't aren't working with me here, but it's it's well made. My hat my hat off to the um, producers of it. So, hold on to you. So, as I'm getting really tired. I'm gonna have to call it quits here because I have no idea what I sound like right now. It just to be honest, it sounds kind of terrible. So I'll talk to you next time. Adios.